and a few other Little Mix YouTubers came together to do a joint collab, a Mixers holiday itinerary, just in time for holiday's release on Friday, July 24th, that will show how to stream and why it's important to stream. The schedule and the other YouTube channels with their respective videos will be in the description. Be sure to check out the other amazing YouTubers and their previous as well as upcoming videos from Mixers Holiday Week. Go watch this crucial video by Ellen the Dream on why it is important to stream if you haven't already. Today's video is about how to quote unquote stream on Shazam and why it's also pretty important. Shazam is an app that can identify songs from a short sample recorded with the microphone. Usually people use Shazam when they hear a song and they don't know what it's called. But Shazam can also be used to get radio play. Shazam doesn't actually contribute any streams towards charts like Billboard or iTunes, but nonetheless, it is almost as important as YouTube, Spotify, and Apple Music. This is because radios will look at the Shazam charts to find songs that are in demand. So what are the Shazam charts? Basically, every country has charts that list the most Shazam songs in that country. Every week, radios will look at the songs that are on the top of their local Shazam charts and then play them because songs that are high in the charts are popular and in demand. This means that the more Shazam a song is getting in a certain area, the higher the chance that that song will be played on the radio in that area. This means that if Holiday is high on the Shazam charts, more radios will play the song and more people will hear Holiday. If we want Holiday and future Little Mix singles to be played on the radio, it's important to quote unquote stream them on Shazam. If you want to hear Holiday on the radio in your country, be sure that you and other mixers in your country are Shazamming the song. It is actually super easy to quote unquote stream songs on Shazam and it doesn't take much time. You'll need either your phone or your phone and another device that can play Holiday. First, download and open the Shazam app. It's available on Android and Apple. Then you can either play Holiday on your second device and then Shazam the song by doing so. Or you can use the Auto Shazam feature. To use the Auto Shazam feature, you long press instead of just tapping the Shazam button and then switch to an app and play the song. If you need it to be quieter, then use headphones with the mic right next to the earpiece. Every time Shazam recognizes the song, one Shazam is added. Shazams usually only count every 24 hours, but if you clear your data, you can Shazam the song an unlimited amount of time. After you have Shazam the song, go to my library, press the gear on the upper left, scroll down to Shazam account. A screen will pop up where they say, save your Shazam and they want you to make an account or log in if you have an account already. It's pretty quick uh, to just use Facebook or email. Once you've been logged in, log out and press remove so that you remove all your Shazams. Then just repeat this process over and over again to get more Shazams. Press app info on Shazam, open storage, then clear data. Shazamming is super easy and quick to do, and of course you don't have to waste a lot of your time on it. You can even do this while streaming Holiday on YouTube, Spotify, Apple Music, etc. So basically it's a two-in-one deal. And if you have 10 minutes to spare, then I don't see why you can't just Shazam the song a couple of times. A little bit of Shazamming can go a long way. 